Today's video is all about a red lip and glowing skin and I'm going to walk you through how I get that look. Before. A troll. Okay, starting off we want to do a serum base with some sunscreen. Then we're going to do a pore clogger minimizer. <laughs> Put that evenly around your face. Then I like to use this Marcel Luminous Beige. It also has sunscreen in it. as kind of like a foundation. Then I have this e.l.f. Uh, liquid concealer. Put that on all my dark spots. Blend, blend, blend. Then I have a green cover up that covers up the redness in your undertones. It's very good for covering up scars and acne. Would recommend. Next is Marcel powder. Blend all over. Then I have Smashbox matte bronzer to do my Kim Kardashian look. AK to do the uh, word I can't remember right now. Make it look bronze. Okay, then we have the Benefit. It smells friggin' delicious. Smell it. Um, Benefit, very lovely. Some blush. Make you look not sickly and rosy. blend into the hairline. Then uh, I always add another blush just to get it to pop a little bit the, and get my cheekbones to appear higher. I do a lighter one and kissy kissy. Born to Glow NYX is my go-to. It I use it as a bronzer and to like finish up. I blend that into my hairline around or everywhere I already put the bronzer. It just makes you look glowy. Anastasia. Pretty in pink is my lovely friend over here. Moonchild Glow Kit. Looks great. CoverGirl Eyebrow Pencil. So it looks like I have eyebrows. Always check to make sure that, that they look extra angry before you go out. And then I like to put some eyebrow pencil gel over them to make them look even more angrier and show up. As you can see, it looks like I have eyebrows now. Okay, e.l.f. This is eyelid primer. I have oily skin and I need this if I want all day wear for my eyeshadow. Here's some extra highlighter that I've been using from Quo, I believe. Then I line my lips and use some Smashbox Red. Here's the palette I use for my eye makeup. I'm just doing a very basic finger blend. I am not a professional. Um, going with lightest into the inside of your creases, of your waterline, and then to the outwards. I like to start with a gel pen for my eyeliner, and then I'll go in with the liquid eyeliner over top of that because I don't trust myself. Even after all of these years. And you will always need to touch this up unless you're like very, very good. Meow. A lovely cat eye. I like the black is black. I use tattoo uh, ink eyeliner and it makes my hazel green eyes just pop. Next is Luscious Lashes 
by Smashbox. I've been using these. They really separate your lashes well. And ta-da! There we go. Time to go slay the day away. Yep. Okay, thank you for coming. Yeah. And to finish it off, I like to do a bit of white eyeliner on the lid. It just makes your eyes pop a little bit. And really brings in that 60s style. Very subtle, but I like.